To be able to use the voice control of the Tibet and Himalaya models, the first thing we have to do is to download the TIA app, register and start the app. Once we have downloaded and registered the app, we then click on add device. We add the device and then we click here. Follow the instructions that follow. You will need to restart the device by turning it on, then off, then on again. Click next and confirm that the light is flashing. Please now enter your Wi-Fi and password and it will then start in search mode. Remember that you have to turn it on and off, not from the remote control, but from the wall switch. In case there is no wall switch that is connected directly to the electric breaker, you will have to do this process, turn the device on and off from the main breaker. En el caso de que no haya un interruptor de pared que esté conectado directamente a, a la red eléctrica, habría que hacer este proceso encendiendo y apagando eh, el aparato desde eh, la luz general. Once it has been paired, we can then click on edit the name of the device. Sea, uh, And in this case, for example, we are going to call it bedroom. El nombre del aparato y en este caso, por ejemplo, vamos a llamarle dormir and save. Then we need to access the TUYA application where we can control the fan switch. We can give it more speed, less speed, or turn it off. Here is the light control. We can turn it off, turn it on, give it less intensity, more intensity, and also the color temperature to make it more or less. Another option where we can have a countdown timer to turn it off, and another is to add a schedule for automatic power on and off. Finally, to add voice control power, all we have to do is link with Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant and follow the instructions provided by Amazon or Google. For ultimo, para poder añadir el control de voz, lo que tenemos que hacer es vincular con Alexa o con Google Assistant. Tenemos que seguir las instrucciones que nos proporciona Amazon Alexa o Google Assistant.